Long winds taking a toll on communities a couple of weeks ago, knocking down trees, landmarks, even ripping off part of a roof to a school. As News Channel 3's Marley Pinchock shows us, though, after a lot of cleanup and community help, students and staff at Galley Academy Middle School are finally back in the classroom. When I saw the damage, you know, it hits you hard. Uh, it's devastating. It's a sight. Superintendent of Gallipolis City Schools, Craig Wright, says he will never forget. Strong winds ripping off part of the roof at Galley Academy Middle School. I looked at it from a perspective, too, that we were fortunate that we didn't have students in session. No one was hurt. Um, and that the structure, uh, the exhaust vent, caught the actual roof itself and didn't cause further damage to the community and take the lives of others. How to pick up the pieces after a situation like this isn't found in a textbook. But with teamwork from students and staff, as well as their whole community, they were able to get the job done. Temporary repairs to the roof, allowing students to safely return to school. We were fortunate to have community members working around the clock, uh, dropping what they were doing to help us in our time of need, uh, to help us get our students back in session. In fact, we had a crew that was working through Easter so that our students could attend school on Monday. So until a permanent fix for the roof gets underway, the outpour of support from this community allows students to safely return to the classroom to finish up their school year. Marley Pinchock, WSAZ, New Channel 3, Galley County. Now, the superintendent says a permanent fix will happen over the summer. He did say that a new, another roof will be installed strong enough to withstand any intense storms we may see in the future.